It was May 2019. We matched on Hinge. There was a bit of back and forth, uh, but soon the conversation kind of fizzled out. I think my chat was a bit basic. A few weeks later, though, by miraculous chance, Baker Street tube station, I saw a girl coming down the escalator the opposite way. And my initial thoughts were, I recognise her. That's that girl off Hinge. She's absolutely stunning. I need to give this another go. So, for the first day, which she agreed to come on, I splashed out and took her to Brewdog in Soho. <laughs> I know how to treat a lady well. But it quickly became very apparent we had a lot in common, and there's definitely a spark. With your warm, bubbly personality, people immediately gravitate towards you. You make friends effortlessly. I love your cute smile and how much you laugh at your own jokes. It gives me the greatest pleasure to welcome you here today to celebrate the marriage of Sin Heng and Daniel here at St Stephen's in the heart of Hampstead. They would like me to thank you all for making the journey to be here with them today and I know they are very much looking forward to celebrating with you throughout the evening. Daniel, I promise to always care for you and connect with you. I promise to respect you and to share all that is to come, to give and to receive, to speak and to listen. We have learnt to navigate each other's differences and I'm lucky that you accept me as I am. You bring joy to my life and make me laugh like nobody else. I can't wait to continue this adventure with you. Sin, I fell in love with your kindness, your cute smile and your outlook on life. I promise to be there for you, to always support you and to celebrate you. I promise to be by your side, wherever it may take us, and to make every day special. You embrace all my quirks, and we both share the same vitality for life. Together, I know that we will accomplish so much. I can't wait to continue this adventure with you. Above all, may you always believe in each other, and may the warmth of your love enrich not only your lives, but the lives of all of those around you. And so it gives me the greatest pleasure to present you as husband and wife. Congratulations, you may kiss. I remember when I first introduced you to my friends. We were at the theatre, just about to watch a play, and whilst heading to our seats, I looked back at my friends for the inaugural seal of approval. And what I actually saw was this wide-eyed giddiness, which roughly translated to, he's a good lad, you better not mess this up. Perhaps they had a sense of a great thing before, you realize, before I realized that you were the one. You're an incredible man and I love you fiercely. You test me intellectually and you're playfully competitive. You're really good at maths and making sure I'm not late to everything. Early on when we were dating, after a big night out, I turned towards you and asked you what you wanted, expecting you to say maybe a drink of water or a fillet of fish sandwich. He emphatically stated, I just want to dance. <laughs> and we have, from raving in medieval fortresses, on med Mediterranean beaches, to dancing around our home with Shakira in our arms.
life is infinitely more fun when we're together. So, can everyone raise a glass to toast my new husband Daniel to a lifetime of dancing with you?